Uh oh, he's in trouble again. Boris Johnson has been referred to the police over new claims that he broke COVID lockdown rules. That's right, it's in the news. The former Prime Minister's ministerial diary revealed that he'd been visited by friends during lockdown. So he sort of snitched on himself there. If you think about it, it is quite disgusting because this was at the time when they were encouraging everyone to stay at home and be safe. Don't go to work. Don't get in touch with loved ones. You weren't even allowed to visit a sick family member because of the, the strict rules and guidelines that they had in place because they were telling us that this is to protect us and it's for the greater good whilst they're, they're conducting things like parties. The news breaks that the Cabinet Office has passed concerns to the Metropolitan Police and Thames Valley Police. As if the country needed anything else to worry about, we've got this whole new fiasco labelled as Party Gate. The headlines read that the news has sparked calls for Mr Johnson to step down as an MP. But sources close to him call the referral clearly politically motivated and claim that the Cabinet Office did not give him any notice so he could put forward the facts before the report was made. A spokesperson for Boris has spoken out saying some abbreviated entries in Mr Johnson's official diary were queried by Cabinet Office during preparation for the COVID inquiry. Following an examination of the entries, Mr Johnson's lawyers wrote to the Cabinet Office and Privileges Committee explaining that the events were lawful and were not breaches of any COVID regulations. Police are currently assessing concerns, but a formal investigation has not yet been launched. The whole government is a mess. A lot of people are not happy with the news. Deputy Leader Daisy Cooper said that it's outrageous that rumours of alleged rule breaking by Boris Johnson are still being drip fed to the general public. The fact that it's one rule for them and one rule for the rest of us still triggers a raw sense of injustice in millions of people. Sunak must make sure that not a single penny more of a taxpayer's money is spent on Johnson's legal fund. And Johnson should finally do one decent thing and consider his position as an MP. Now, if there's one thing that I know about politicians, they've got an ego bigger than Mount Everest. Is he going to resign? I very much doubt it. They do tend to wait till they get pushed uh, rather than actually making the decision to just quietly leave and do the decent thing. So I can't imagine him leaving, but they, it is going to increase pressure on uh, Johnson as a whole to make the move and exit. I think there should be a full on inquiry into Boris Johnson as a whole. He was never fit for the role that he played in the whole COVID pandemic and he's not fit now as an MP. There should be a vote that he should be taken out. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Like and subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.